What's good, YouTube? It's your man, man, Color and I'm back with another video. And today, I'll be making a 3D scene and Godot for it. Here, guys, I'm finally making a video with it. It's about damn time. Time to test out this new software. I've been getting a lot of requests to do this lately, so I'm finally doing it. New lighting, graphics, layout, and video. Make sure y'all like and subscribe. I hope y'all had a great weekend. Please subscribe to the channel. I'm trying to 500 subscribers sometime in May, so your subscription is much appreciated. And with all that being said, let's get right into the video. So upon opening Godel 4, I just kind of looked around and tinkered a little bit. As I was doing so, I noticed a few changes here and there, but nothing too drastic. It was mostly the same layout. I was going for a foggy cliff scene, so I started working on the fog in the world environment. I saw some very nice and subtle changes there too. I like how the sky had its own panel, so it wasn't just mixed in with the background. This would provide for some better editing. There were some nice icon changes as well, but it wasn't anything too crazy to where you would have to go back and relearn the whole software again. Now I just looked and I'm using Godel 4 Alpha 1, currently Godel 4 alpha 5 is out please don't get those numbers mixed up because the Dell 5 is not out one thing you'll notice when opening this is that some of the shortcuts do not work now the only reason i'm mentioning that is because it bothered me a little bit it's probably fixed in other versions of it but it just bothered me because i like shortcuts a lot i didn't fully utilize the lighting capabilities since i wanted to make a darker scene with all the fog and stuff importing stuff was a lot 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 smoother than it was in Godot 3 i'll tell you that right now it may just be my computer but there would be a lot of lag episodes with Godot 3 where you would import or something and for no reason it just stop loading then you have to close and then re-add the thing and then figure out what's wrong if you didn't save the scene you have to make it over again it's this whole thing i don't recall having any lag issues while using this so that's a plus <laughs> Now, I was going to make a terrain, but I didn't have the add-on, so that got scrapped. But overall, I love the new options that were available now. Before, I never really gave any of this too much thought since it wasn't the full version, and I was just going to wait till the full version released. But this is definitely worth making more videos with, for sure. I will do my best to get some more complex scenes so you guys can see the lighting and things of that nature. One thing I hope that gets added is the easier way to maneuver around the 3D viewport. I am not sure if there are ways to do that, but if so, let me know in the comments down below. And now that I'm done with this video, I'm out of here.